so in this video you will learn how a field telecom engineer start the activity of telecom installation and guide his field team from the layout so let's check out this tower leg and 37 meter is the height of this tower and from layout we can easily uh, compare the height with the tower at the side end and at 37 meter we have the RF antenna so now check leg 1 and at the leg 1 the existing 1800 RRU installed and existing quad band antenna is also installed with 70 degree azimuth at 37 and 36 meter height respectively and uh, at the leg one existing RRU and antenna is installed on this mount and now leg one and leg two is almost complete now we will move on to the uh, leg three and leg four at leg four uh, you can check this red handwriting and it indicates that you have to propose the new RRU on this leg 4 at 35 meter so you will discuss this with your teammates that at the leg 4 you need to install the RRU at this 35 meter height so this RRU type is uh, 2100 megahertz and the antenna is also 2100 megahertz now at the type at the top right bottom you can check that leg 1 2 3 and 4 respectively at leg 4 you don't need to install anything and leg 1 2 and 3 indicates the data of quad band antenna with 3700 MHz the height and the azimuth 70 degree and for the 2 and leg 3 is 180 and 260 degrees respectively and antenna type is also shown as 900 MHz on leg 1 leg 2 leg 3 you can cross verify this with the help of your teammates during the installation time and if they found any uh, difference in the layout and at the tower top so you can discuss with your POC that the layout is not as per plan now this one is the sector 1 antenna and sector 2 and sector 3 how you can verify that you have to add the new RRU and the existing jumpers uh, with RRU and antenna so this layout will find you the best as 2100 MHz will connect this plus minus 45 degree and sector 1 sector 2 and sector 3 you need to install the filter with RRU and red 1 red 2 indicates the color coding and green 2 green 3 also indicates the color coding so before proceeding the installation first you will use the uh, color coding scheme and you will guide your teammates so before uh, starting the installation they must take the color tipping with them at the tower top so this color tipping help out to avoid the swap issue so when you check this layout that rru is also installed with filter and that red dotted line indicates the jumper wire so uh, sector 3 sector 2 and sector 1 each rru have the dotted lines which indicates that new jumper must be installed with filter and rru and the next one is the cascading fiber which is shown below at the rru and uh, let me show you the cascading fiber that cascading fiber must be installed with the RRU from end to end so this one is one of the basic criteria for a field telecom engineer to guide his teammates while uh, doing this activity at site so if you learn this layout plan and you can understand this basic technology terminologies so you can guide your teammates which includes the rigor and technicians 
and you can get the best results